Have you noticed the vending machines around the school missing throughout the F wing and C wing? Students appreciated their usefulness as it was convenient for them to purchase a drink or a quick snack rather than waiting in long lines at food outlets. Media Relations Director Jay Robb was able to give us more information on the situation. So what we've, uh, what we've done, we've consolidated the vending machines in one central location um, with federal renewal that's going on. Um, as a lot of students have seen, we've revamped the cafeteria, right? So we've created a food court, we've added a Starbucks. Uh, longer hours, better food selection, so we thought here's a chance also to put vending machines in one place. Um, that saves us uh, on energy costs um, because vending machines are sort of energy hogs, right? So we can pull the plugs on a lot of the machines. Um, we can service them better, right? So when food runs out, it's easier. I think we've all gone to vending machines where it hasn't had what we wanted after we've put our money in it or nothing's come out after we've put our money in it. So uh, there'll be better machines, better selection in uh, one location. The hours are longer, um, which is good news for students because now you don't have to s sort of make a meal out of what's in the vending machine. Um, so there, there'll be more food, healthier food available uh, at more times of the day and night. So we're gonna take a look at what's in the machines. We wanna give students more options and healthier options uh, because we also recognize there are students who sort of work here 24 seven, right? So even though the hours are extended, we do have some students who wind up eating out of vending machines. We just wanna make sure that you have great choice, healthier choices, and you, you get what you put your money in for. In the redesign of uh, food services, uh, putting the, I think putting the staircase where it is now, it's easier for students to get there. Students all know where to go. Uh, it's quicker to get there. There's an elevator now, there's the staircase. Um, so I think, um, and so while it may not be right around the corner, it's at most a five minute walk for students, pretty much from anywhere in the campus. And when you get to the vending machines, it'll have what you're looking for. It'll probably have more than you uh, usually expect from a vending machine. With the reduced number of vending machines, the students will not have a huge loss. But rest assured, the MSA will do what is best to ensure that the students get the service they deserve. For Mohawk News, I'm Phil James.